Hello guys, guys, how are you doing to all our followers and fans here in the Gambian abroad today is the game against Mali in Bamako and this is the final remark from the coach Tom Sheffield with the boys. We wish them the best of luck and hopefully they come with the three points on the first game ahead in Mali. It was a villa away, it's a surprise, but we knew that when we beat Congo uh, South Sudan, that was a tough opponent. We were happy with these points. Tomorrow it will be the toughest game away against Mali, number 45 in the world, 81 positions better than us. And uh, more than 22 years ago that uh, Gambia won against them in a friendly match. They are a strong team, even if they miss some quality players, uh, they have all players on high level. But uh, we miss some players, but the team we have here assembled here has shown the last days to be ready. Um, they are fit, they are fresh, they are hungry. Um, and it would be very good if away game uh, that we can steal some points. We will see. We will never be satisfied with a, a, a loss. Uh, we want minimum one point and if possible three points. But we have to be realistic. This is a very tough opponent. Uh, and we are here to, to steal something. The atmosphere is good. The group is good. The hotel, the surroundings, everything is good. So let's hope we can show it tomorrow on the pitch. I mean, we missed seven central midfield players compared to AFCON. Uh, some of them stopped uh, playing football, some of them have no club, others are injured. Then we miss some quality central defender. Uh, we miss Steve Trawali and James Gomez, Ibu Adams, Yusuf Abob, uh, Ibrahim Adarbu. So we miss a lot of quality players. But we can't talk about what we don't have. We have still a lot of quality players. And tomorrow there will be uh, 11 uh, Scorpions, 11 Gambians on the pitch who will do everything for the country. And we have a lot of quality. We have for sure a lot of offensive quality, but we must be careful not to concede goals. Congo Brazzaville conceded after 38 seconds here a goal. And after nine minutes, it's was already 2-0. Their game was over after nine minutes. So we have to be smart, uh, control the game in our quality, and hopefully we get some uh, offensive actions with our quality players to make that goal what could be important. It's also what will, will decide. So we miss players, but uh, we don't have to talk about them. I'm very satisfied with the 24 players available here. You know, there are some players that are coming for the first time. I mean, so far, can you tell us what we have seen in those new players that are coming? Yeah, we, we, we sc uh, scouted them and uh, tomorrow uh, could be that one of them going to make uh, the debut from the start. We will see. We will keep that a little bit secret. Um, but uh, yeah, we, we always uh, try the last uh, five years, 36 players made their debut in the, in the national team. We always look for alternatives. Sometimes people don't know why we are selecting players because we know already from the information we get that players are not available with injuries, with illness, and we need always positions uh, covered. We need uh, on every position alternatives, and these are uh, players who, who are able to perform uh, together with the experienced players and some players who returned after an absence of, uh, of a few months and a few years. Thank you, Coach. You're welcome.